good. How are you? Fabulous. Except I think I'd say fabulous today. <laughs> except for I'm not on vacation, really, but that's I a different know. story. <laughs> All right, but that's me. why I was surprised to receive, you know, one email after another. I'm like, I, I think know. you're going to be broken. It's like, okay, I guess we're going to have to go to like a different continent. All right. I let think, me know. <laughs> I think so. Okay, let me know if you see the charts. Uh, it's just a black screen right now. Okay, yes. Okay, all right, there you go. All right, so tell me what you did. So you had a great day. I'm really proud of you. You really did take the stuff that we talked about last week and you did it. Yes, I. you said to take them and to keep my risks uh, where I can risk at. Mm -hmm. And I took all of them, except, of course, for the That's expensive great. one, which we talked about. Yes. That's fabulous. So you did uh -huh. four trades or five trades, or how many did you end up doing? Um, I did one, two, three, four. Four trades, okay. and then the Netflix is the fifth one. Okay, yeah. so you did five trades today. Uh -huh. Yes. And you made how much in total? Do you know how much in total? Do you add it up? Ooh, about 1,000 plus total. So you did one contract of each? Yes, I did. Perfect. Okay, that's good. And mm -hmm. so, so the last time I talked to you last week, you were worried about your account and you, yeah. you hadn't been doing anything for a couple of weeks because you were, you were in that holding position where you were in the fear mode. So now yeah. you did it. Now you're back up again in the account and everything's good, right? It's awesome. I feel great. <laughs> I said, I got to listen to you. And you're like, do you trust me? I go, yes, of course I do. Okay, I'll just take the trades. <laughs> you're so funny. Now, okay, did you do all the trades yesterday? Or did you do all the trades today? Or did you only do one day? Because I called 12. Like, what did you do from yesterday till today? Okay, I did, yesterday I did the um, Spy, mm -hmm. Apple, um the cues and dia okay. and i i wish i held on because um the spy and the dia i close it off you know because you know um when we talked about it uh, about profits there's nothing wrong with that so oh, you I got out before the close yesterday yes, oh, yes. Oh, yeah okay and then i looked at your email but i still had apple and the cues i was okay. still in those ones but when I saw your email this morning, I'm like, holy smokes. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 So then when you put in the um, um, email again this morning, mm -hmm. I did get back again on the spy and, um, yeah, just a spy. And then I took the, uh, the DIA and the, and the Netflix this afternoon, you know, the afternoon. But, yeah, I, I did go back and I'm like, oh, my God. Yeah, no, no. I mean, I'm calling yeah. so many here lately, but I think, you know, again, once you build your account up, then you can hold some of them a little bit. But right now, yeah. because you were starting with a small account, I don't think it's a problem for you to get out when you were up, which we talked about, and you're yeah. doing the trains and becoming more active. So do you, do you understand that every time you do it, you do it, you make money, you make money. Do you see how your confidence has built so much in the last two days? Yeah, that? absolutely. Big difference. Yeah. <laughs> Big difference. Thank you for the talk. I really appreciated that. Yeah. So overall now, um, like going forward, what mm -hmm. is your risk now per trade? What are you risking? 200, 100? What are you risking? Um, yeah, around uh, 250 to 300, not more than 300. Not so, more than 300. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So you didn't do Amazon because that was no. out of your price range, which was fine. Yes. Even though it worked. And then you didn't do Google either. No, I did not. Okay, that's fine. But do you see how they they worked, but do you see it would have skewed your results because you wouldn't have been consistent with the monetary yeah, absolutely. risk? Yeah. Absolutely, yes. Yeah, but once you get your account up, you'll be able to do those big ones, and that's fine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you for your advice. <laughs> so what's your, what's your, how are you managing this? Because I know you work... You work some of the days, and how, how did you figure all this out in the, in the last two days? Because you were at work. Um, actually, I was off yesterday, and I'm off today, oh. so it worked out. 
And um, yeah, after you, you were sending these emails, I'm like, oh, I better stay at home. She's shooting emails. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> I said, I thought she was on vacation. What are you I doing on vacation? I was too, but obviously, the, the, I mean, what are you going to do? It's there, it's there. The market's like, okay, fine, you know, I'm here. So. Yeah. <laughs> and it's so funny because my husband and I, okay, we're going to go out. And I'm like, no, 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 Melissa's shooting emails. I got to stay at home. <laughs> we got to do it another day. <laughs> I thought she's not on vacation. I can't, I can't believe this. It's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. What does your husband think of you doing this trading thing? Um. Well, at first, you know, he, he was skeptical about it and everything. And I'm more of the risky person. Mm -hmm. And he's like, okay, um, go ahead. Let's give it a chance. You know, give it a chance because you're so interested in it. And, uh, you know, she, she, whenever he comes and peeks in, he's like, oh, my God, is that Melissa calling those trades? Gosh, she sounds so excited. I'm like, I know. That's it also hilarious. perks me up and everything, you know. So it's like I, I'm with it. I, I want to do this. Yeah. He said, okay. Let's do it. <laughs> well, that's great. That's wonderful. To have a very supportive partner like that to help you. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. So, what <laughs> about you? Said you were picking up your son. How old is he? Oh, he's uh, sixteen. He's in high school. Okay, so he's old enough to understand a little bit about the market. Yeah, he goes, oh, mommy, you got to teach me that. That sounds exciting. Every time he says <laughs> goodbye to me in the morning, gives me a kiss. I'm like, okay, okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. He you goes. Know, I, always, I always thought that that young kids would be good because they're so impressionable that they'd understand the market really well because they have no preconceived notions. Do you know what I mean? Yes, that's right. That's right. Oh, <laughs> All right. So listen, your plan of action now between now and the end of the week is what? Uh, plan of action. I'll still continue to do these. Uh, I, I'm actually. I actually have a class tomorrow, mm -hmm. so I'll see how this holds out for the week, the my DIA and um, Netflix okay, position. So what are you in? You're in still, you didn't close out Diamonds and Netflix. Yes, I'm okay. still in those. So you're in two. And that's so it's it. kind of flat right now, right? Or a little bit, you know, okay. under, but it's, um, my stomach is tolerating it better than <laughs> what I had the past in the past, so. <laughs> Oh my God, you're funny. But the, the, honestly, there's no downside here because today and yesterday and last week were such big trades. So there's no downside. Like it's very, very difficult to predict where the low is going to be if you're shorting or the high yeah. in a long. So I say the best thing is to get out. You do have to okay. watch what's going on. When you get up in the morning and I start to send emails like that, it's, a, it's an alert to tell you to watch what's happening. Do you know what I mean? Yes, got it. But yeah. honestly, when I called these, I had no idea that Mueller was going to be talking at 11 o'clock. I didn't know that yesterday. I didn't know that this morning. I didn't know that when I sent out any of those trades, you know? Yeah, that was that was amazing. But yeah, I got out early today mm -hmm. before. I think I got out like around 9, close to 10 o'clock. And then after 11, everything just went, whew. Yeah. Right now. <laughs> I'm like, well, oh, shoot. <laughs> well, wait a minute. Did you do the new ones then? You did the new ones and you took them and you got out right away? Or what did you do with the new ones? Oh, I closed out the uh, DIA yesterday. So I okay. went back in it again today when you send out oh, the email. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. And uh, the Netflix, I also did. So I'm still in uh, DIA and Netflix. But um, like what you said, um, there are two big down days and we don't know where we're going. I have class tomorrow, so I may close it out okay, tomorrow well just, morning. Yeah, I mean, just I have absolutely no idea where we gap tomorrow morning. So I can't, I mean, there's nothing for me to even figure out here or rate because this is mm -hmm. very volatile. But anyways, do you have any quick questions for me at all? No, um, thank you. No, I'm absolute. I feel more confident and not as scared as I was before mm -hmm. <laughs> when you were emphasizing your risk to reward and, um, you know, keep it consistent in terms of the amount you want to risk. So there's a consistency also mm -hmm. when, with the gains and, you know, if ever there's a loss, it's a uh, minimal loss or you know, go all the way, you know. <laughs> yeah, going forward, though, if you're up like yesterday into the close, and say you have two things on. Now, just listen to what I'm saying. If okay. you have two things on and they're positive into the close, unless it's some Jimungo amount, you could exit one and you could hold the other one. And you could okay. start to do that. Like you could have split it up because you would have made more if you had held it because we gapped down because they were oh, close. Yeah. So next time you could, 
what what you'll find like sh prove to yourself you can do it do it do it which you did now the last week and i'm saying then you could piecemeal it a little bit chunk it out take half out hold half take a take some of them out hold a little bit of the ones do you know what i mean uh-huh yeah got it but with um one contract it's either just the one contract itself I right know, but that's what i'm saying if i call four trades you could get out uh -huh. of two and hold okay. two or you get out of three and hold one is what i'm saying got it that you got do. it yeah yeah like neck i mean it's very difficult to say at this moment at the second because i don't know what happens thursday and friday and again we're very volatile but for the, yes. for the ones that you have that are out till june you don't necessarily have to exit everything tomorrow you could okay. hold one of the two is what i'm saying okay. so just see what happens but you do have to open Got up it. your charts and you do have to look at it and you do have to Got pay it. attention to what's going on absolutely okay i got it so now did you double your account in the last day or you made 25 percent, or what did you make of it yeah about uh about 22 percent. that's great that's great yeah, Sheila. you absolutely. did really good yeah, yeah you did really thank good. you yeah. you did fabulous just one one fix like that one phone conversation with me just one tweak in it do you see how just that one thing yes that was over the weekend and i i said okay i'm going for it coming Tuesday, but I was like just hoping for day trades, but I wasn't expecting a <laughs> explosion of emails from you. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, you're funny. All right, well, tell your husband and your son I said hi. Okay, and, I definitely uh, will. Yes, all right, have a good evening, and I will talk to you later. Okay, all right, thank you, all Melissa. Right. Okay, Great enjoy time. your vacation. Uh, yes. All right, whatever. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Okay. Have a good night. Bye-bye. All right. Bye-bye.